Old Colt and Gelding Trot, presented by Country Lane Standard Breads. Four to five on TCI, six to five on Carl. Here they come. They are up. Security protected, started well, and goes up to grab the early lead. Mr. Bluebird, there goes TCI, and TCI glides right up now and takes the lead. Security protected, second. Mr. Bluebird is third. Carl came away fourth. Private access is next fifth. Muscle Fantastic is into sixth. After that, it's Greenspan, then Dashing Danny with Wild Ticket and Situation Ship, tenth and last after a first quarter of 26 and four. TCI is the leader. Pocketed second is security protected. Carl is not going to wait. Here comes Carl up from the fourth position, now moving up to challenge TCI, and the two of them are right together. Carl goes on to take the lead. TCI back to second as the field comes to the half-mile mark in 56-1. and one. Moving to that second turn, Carl has taken the lead. TCI is second. Security protected, followed by Muscle Fantastic, who's up on the outside. Then Mr. Bluebird to the inside with private access and Greenspan. Then Dashing Danny, Wild Ticket, and Situation Ship. As they approach the top of the stretch, it's Carl. TCI is second. Security protected third. Head of the stretch, headed for home. Three quarters, 125. Carl is in front. TCI angles out, and this is what we wanted. The two fabulous freshman trotters, one, two, coming into the final eighth of a mile. Carl is in front and pulling away. Carl now in front by three. TCI is second, and security protected back in third. It is Carl, who is a dominant victor tonight, winning with Yannick Jingra in 151-4. and four. TCI second. Third was security protected. Private access fourth. And again that time, 151 and four. That is a stakes record and a track record. Was the matchup we were waiting for, Bob Hayden, at Carl in 51 and 4. Yep, a new track record, and uh, the temperature certainly helps. But wow, this is the kind of the kind of effort Carl showed early on, right from the start. He was <laughs> he could natural ability in abundance, and how about TCI? He's giving it those all. You got to love the year he has. The richest two-year-old trotter in the history of harness racing. In the history of harness racing, and uh, the score is even. The TCI a winner yep. down in Lexington. One, one. Carl now at the Breeders' Crown. 1-1, one, one, as you say. New track record, stakes record, and a new, no, not a new lifetime bet for Carl. Sent off as the 3-5 to five favorite, getting the job done for Team Tactor and Crawford Farms and Nancy Tactor, Black Horse Racing, and Bender Sweden. And Nancy now takes over the lead, the all-time leading uh, female trainer, 9, and she uh, breaks a tie with Linda at 8. And uh, Ron Burke was just one, two, three in the other race. Now he's uh, with a solid second. Uh, this is one of those, one, one of the few we've had tonight, which was as advertised. As advertised it was. Carl, your newest Breeders' Crown champion. Yeah, this is really great. Number one, Carl posted first. Number five, TCI second. Number four, security protected third. Number two, private access fourth. One, five, four, two is the unofficial order of finish. Returning to the winner's circle, 
is number one, Carl, a two-year-old colt by Tactical Landing, out of Avalicious by RC Royalty, bred by Crawford Farms, LLC, owned by Christina and Nancy Tactor, Black Horse Racing, Crawford Farms Racing, and Bender Sweden. Nancy Tactor is the trainer. Yannick Gingra, the winning driver. The caretaker is Miguel Guetta. And again, the time of 151 and 4 is both a stakes and track record. Race 13 results official. And there in the winner's circle is the winner of the two-year-old Colt and Gelding Trot. Breeders' Crown Race presented by Country Lane Standard Breads. And that is Carl, winner of seven of eight this year. Carl pays three forty for the win in race thirteen. The twenty cent super facta eleven dollars eighty four cents. Two dollar exacta five twenty fifty cent trifecta seven dollars thirty cents. The two dollar pick four four of four correct one thousand three hundred ninety dollars forty cents. Here's crown championship of night one. Two year old Colton Gelding Trot goes to Carl as he wins the rematch against TCI Yannick Jingra for Nancy Tactor and. A bunch of real happy owners over there, that's for sure, celebrating. This is what it's all about. Yannick, uh, let's take me through this trip here. You know, tell me first up, how was your horse feeling where he was settled in fourth? Oh, he was fine in the hole, but uh, first before all of this, all credit to Nancy. Um, you know, last week he was not the same horse I had tonight. Uh, uh, she changed her shoes, she changed her bit, she changed her, a bunch of things on the horse, and, uh, you know, she, she gambled and uh, it paid off. The horse, uh, you know, she sent me a video of him yesterday and he looked tremendous and, uh, had all the confidence in the world in, in the horse, but uh, even more, even more so after I saw the. No, he looked. He made that patented move, you know, sitting fourth, clearing to the lead. Just how powerful is he when he brushes like that? Oh, he's just so fast. You know, he's got uh, gears that. Uh, I mean, I, in my opinion, I think he's the best horse I've ever sat behind. That's all, all wow. high I think of this horse. And uh, he, he, tonight, uh, I thought it was unbelievable. Uh, he come 26 and four last quarter, and uh, I was pulling on him behind the wire like I was behind the gate still. He just uh, no, I was a winner and didn't want to do anything crazy. But uh, he's got such abilities. Um, you know, I thought high of him at the beginning of the year, and uh, but you wanted to do the, the horse led to do the talking, you know. But uh, right now, I, I can definitely call him the best two-year-old I've ever drove. And that's high praise. Sensational rookie season for him. Is there a certain performance that stands out to you with him? Well, tonight, obviously, okay. number one, it's uh, it's a great performance. But uh, he's had so many of them. He won in 51 in Lexington, uh, no, five, four or five stars back. I thought it was really impressive. But uh, to do it the way he did it tonight, um, after 
no, not having the best week last week, you know, uh, I think it's uh, it's tremendous. It speaks uh, volume, I think, is in his ability. How great would it be for racing if both Carl and TCI can come back just as good next year? Oh, they will because, you know, both trainers are great trainers. Uh, Guarani shows that year after year his horses come back. Uh, you know, God Foyle again came back for 12 years straight, you know. So, like, uh, no, I know Ronnie's horse is going to come back and he'll be fine. And uh, Nancy is going to do a great job, too. So, I, I think, the, uh, no, the battles between the two of us is definitely not over. Well done, Yannick. Thank you very much. All right, Yannick Jingra for Nancy Tactor. And it is Carl winning in another stakes record of 151 and 4 as we cap off night one of the Breeders' Crown World Championships.